Milestone revenue in Oracle receivables. We are going to conduct this demonstration on El Capitan, which is Apple's latest operating system. And we are also going to use Microsoft's latest operating system, that is Windows 10. Milestone revenue indicates recognition of revenue based on actual milestones. Let us take an example. A typical software implementation project has phases like requirement definition, solution design, conference room, pilot, etc. And say a project start date is 1st January 15. And these are the planned dates of the project and these are the actual dates as the project happened. As per the company policy, the revenue on the project is to be determined or recognized based on the weight given to each phase. So for example, requirement when the requirement definition is completed, 20% of the revenue is to be recognized. That is on 10th March 15. Solution design got completed on 15th May. 25% of the revenue is to be recognized on 15th May. To achieve this functionality, you have to first set up an accounting rule. Navigate to Oracle Applications and Receivables Responsibility and go back to Accounting Rules. Configure an accounting rule, let us call it Milestone Revenue. Choose the type as fixed. Choose your period type, that is month, and choose number of periods as 1. Check deferred revenue and enter 100% in the percent column. That completes the definition of accounting rule. Now let us execute the transaction flow. We will first create a transaction and then we will see how to recognize revenue on respective dates for the same. Create a transaction. The project started on 1st January 15. So we will create a receivables invoice. on that date and we will choose invoicing rule as in advance and go to line items. Choose line items. When you try to save, it will prompt you an accounting rule must be provided for the invoice. So go to rules. Choose the rule that you created in earlier step. Give the duration as 1. Give the start date and save. Complete the invoice. And run the create accounting for the invoice. So we created a transaction. We applied an accounting rule to the transaction. We have done the accounting for the transaction. And now we will see how to recognize the revenue for that invoice. First view the accounting done by the create accounting process. You will notice that on 1st January 15 when the project is started the entire amount has been credited to the unearned revenue. So the revenue has yet not been recognized. Let us go back to the schedule on which we have to recognize the revenue. The first recognition date is 10th March 15 and we are going to recognize a revenue of 20%. Note the number of the transaction. 
and save it in a notepad or some file. For recognizing revenue or for scheduling the revenue, go to control, accounting, revenue accounting. Enter the transaction number for which you want to schedule the revenue and find the transaction. Click on manage the revenue and click on schedule revenue and next. Give the percentage of revenue that you want to recognize. As per this example, we are going to recognize 20% of the revenue for the first phase. Enter the date of revenue recognition as per the example, 10th March Note the journal for 10th March, a revenue of 20% is being recognized. The amount, 20% amount has been transferred from unearned revenue to the revenue. Similarly, you can follow the same process for solution design and the next steps. So we have completed transaction accounting rule, create accounting and recognition of the revenue. And we have also seen the results. For more videos, see facebook.com slash R12 financials book set. Thank you. Hope this video will be helpful to you. Bye-bye.